Hey everybody, Russ Allen, Red Bones Barbecue here. Down here on the beautiful set of Bama Q. Gonna cook, uh, I've got some marinated pork chops here and my homemade white sauce. I know everybody's heard of the Alabama white sauce. I kind of change a little different flair and make my own. We're gonna uh, have it marinated maybe 30, 45 minutes. Gonna be running on the Hasty Bake here and gonna infuse a little mesquite B&B chunks here. I've already got a, a charcoal of B&B briquettes going. So I'm gonna add a little bit of mesquite. Not a whole lot, because it's a strong wood. Burns slow, but it's very hot. So just to give you a little something different out there other than hickory and apple, but this, this mesquite will really put a nice little hand on these pork chops. So I'm gonna get them out of here and let them drain. Just a cheap pack of pork chops from the grocery. I think center cut, they're about half, three quarters inches thick. You can use whatever you want uh, cut wise, you know, uh, loin, uh, uh, boneless. I like the bone in. I always like to have something with a handle on it. It seems to taste better. <laughs> but yeah, you can get this white sauce at, at most uh, grocery stores. There's all kind of brands of it, but uh, if you do want to make you some, just start out with quite a bit of mayonnaise, salt and pepper, and a little white vinegar. I had a little milk to thin it out as a marinade, and then I've got some saved that I did not marinate with for dipping. All right, y'all, we've got these drained a little bit. Let's get over here and get ready to put them on this hasty bait. And I'm gonna drop this B&B mesquite right in here, maybe a couple more little pieces. You don't want to put a whole lot. You don't want it too strong. Get these guys on here. Man, I smell it already. All right, so this is going to be another quick cook. It won't take long. We're going to shoot for an internal of about 145. And we'll close that lid, let some of that smoke get in them. And we'll come back and check on them here in just a couple of minutes. All right, y'all, it's been about another five, maybe six minutes. I went ahead and let them go a little bit. Let's check the temp. They should be ready. Man, I wish y'all could smell it. Perfect. They're averaging about 150 to 152. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull them and uh, get these things set aside. And I'll get them plated up. I got a little side of uh, some coleslaw over here. Look at there, is that not beautiful? Talking about a good weeknight meal right there. Man, we've turned out some pretty pork chops here and I've got some slaw to go with it. Don't take long at all to get this meal prepared. Like I said, marinated in uh, some homemade white sauce which uh, I drew some off. It's all, it's clean, it's not had any pork on it. And what I like to do is just take and come back across just for a little extra zest there, a little extra pop. But uh, I can't wait to get into this thing. That B&B uh, &B mesquite really, okay, so I did have a nibble a while ago. Uh, that mesquite really put a number on them today along with that B&B &B charcoal briquettes. Just gonna be a great meal. I can't wait to get into it. Y'all give it a try at home. Don't take long. One evening after work, everybody's tired. Just throw them on the grill and be done. <laughs>